Oh, it begins. All right, today we're trying Bubbles the Cat as requested by Michelle Chison on Patreon. On Patreon. <laughs> oh, you can change the color. You can customize the cat and give it a little hat, including a dog, which is better than a hat. I agree. There we go. We fixed it. Yeah, there we go. Rainbow mode on or off? You see, this cat was suffering from a tragic case of not being a dog, but we fixed that, so boom. I'm so good at platformers, this won't be a disaster of an episode at all. <laughs> oh no. The cat was chasing a brat, and then it went into a wonderland. And the cat was lost forever, so we play as the dog instead. Haha! <laughs> That's not what bubbles are supposed to do. Oh my god, there's like a creepy tentacle inside of it. And it's made of glass somehow? Wow. This cat just went and fell into a Lovecraftian horror dimension. Okay, that looks suspicious as like a video game level. Hey! Bubbles the cat moves left and right automatically. What? And changes direction on hitting a wall. It's a runner? Oh, that's why it's got rainbow mode, because it's a Nyan Cat meme. I have a double bounce. Oh, this is a phone game. <laughs> this is a phone game as hell. It's got three star scores per level, and it has a control scheme where you basically play the game by tapping the... Yep. Yep, you just- you just tap the screen on the phone and that does the jump slash wall jump or whatever and the rest of the game's just tapping automatically. I getcha. That's what's going on here. Bubbles will slide down after a second. Ah, okay. Well, I gotta get all of the cat food even though I'm a dog. Yes, yes, it is I, a true dog who is always dog. I was always a dog after all. Don't let anyone trick you. It's scandalous. And libelous, because they're lying. Okay, so one star is for being level one, for getting all the food. One of them is for getting all the dog food, excuse me. And for once, <laughs> once for your part time, which I failed the hell out of by not getting the f all the food in the right order. Okay. Whoa, how many double jumps do I get? That's how I can just jump that many times. Okay. There's apparently I, I missed a lot of food. There's apparently 125 levels, I think, is what the trailer said. It will last you a little while. I thought I was gonna miss and I was gonna lose my mind. Now, hi, you tried to fake me out. You can't get me that easily. Uh oh. Ooh, okay, we're good. Oh, he's adorable and also a dog. Very specifically. Oh, jeez. That's, that's an explosive success screen. Is that because I was unlocking something new? Oh, I can just keep jumping for as many balloons I, as I have. Or bubbles, I mean. That's way too many jumps. <laughs> that's a bizarre jump budget. I wonder if there's like later levels that you basically just fly through or something. Oh, I messed up. I mean, I guess this is an example of that. Doing a double jump, doing a triple jump followed by a triple jump just over the giant abyss. You have a maximum of six bubbles. These instantly regenerate whenever you land on the floor. Uh oh. Oh, this is becoming... <gasps> Risky. Good. I keep wanting to save my jumps even though I'm pretty sure... Uh, well, no. If I don't touch the floor, then I don't get, get them back. So I should just do this. Ah, uh, that's not good. Oh no. I'm in trouble. No, we're good. I just, it was the exact budget, so I was nervous. I'm like, these are this is a risk on a scale that we've never done before. <laughs> we're good. Yeah! I failed at all the things. This is actually getting harder. Flip. 
Whip. Whip. Oh no, I hit my head. We're good. Oh no, if you fail a level, the cat comes back to take his game. We can't allow this. You know what? Haha. That's right, ultimate failure. Except I got a part time, which is fine. What does this do? My double jumps are super, super high now. What the hell? Oh, that's how you die. That's a big danger. Explosions from blaster bubbles will also blow weak walls. Try to use the explosion to destroy the walls blocking you. Damn. And by weak walls, we mean a, a loose collection of pebbles. <laughs> Oh, this is agony. There you go. Oh, this power is gonna drive me crazy. Because it's such a it, it goes up at such a at a, such a sheep, uh, steep angle <laughs> that I end up just bouncing off the wall. Why do I want to destroy that piece of wall? That doesn't matter. Why am I coming to that? There we go. Good dog. Ah. I'm too slow. Too much loser mode here. Much che ah. So my goal is to get blaster above all else. Because the goal is hot hidden behind a blaster chunk at the moment. And needs it. There we go. That's right. We need is cat food when you got par time. I'm not an underachiever. I'm, I'm just winning the game, buddies. The only way I know how. Underachieving. Haha! <laughs> oh. No! That's a lot of death hazards. Just all over the screen. All over it. Very risky business. Even though all I did was spam jump because I have six jumps. Seven jumps, technically. Which is very powerful. Look at those giant puppy dog eyes! Oh, he's just so happy. Even though it's a terrifying cat disguise. He's trying to infiltrate dog kind. We can't let him. We can't let him escape the game. Oh, well. Whoops. Powerful, give you waller bubbles. What? What? You just create a wall? That's a power. Okay. I keep expecting a double jump to happen, so it's very, it's like really like jarring. It's a big surprise. You have to double jump twice because the first jump creates the wall and the next jump creates the jump. Oops. I failed. Oh, it's blaster. I thought we were doing walls. My bad. Whoop. Oop. Nah. Do -do -do -do. I got half. <laughs> I got half of the items. That was just an all-around failure on my part. Not my proudest mo uh, moment all around. Ba -doof. Ba -doof. Aha. Oh, jeez. I killed them. I killed them all. I didn't know that was an option. <laughs> I didn't realize that this this move kills them. A real powerful trick to have access to. Wow, yeah, they just all die. I'm a little slime murderer, aren't I? Yeah. Oh, this level's designed to, to make you notice you can kill them by making it really hard not to kill them. That was a form of tutorialization. I see what you're doing there. Hit. Hit. You can't catch me, I'm moving fast. No, I'm not. I'm not moving faster than you as it turns out. Oh, big risk, big risk, mega risk. Okay, that was a little stressful. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Yeah. 
Yeah. Hip, 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 hip. And we're good. Not gonna lie though, I keep having the thought of like, all right, that's probably enough for an episode. And I look over and it's like, what do you mean it's only been 10 minutes? <laughs> I think it's something, something about the perception of time gets destroyed by the feeling of beating like 30 levels or whatever. Like we're bringing through level count so fast that it, it feels like I've been playing for way longer than I have. Although these arcade games, I usually make it like a, instead of like a 30 or 40 minute episode, I usually make like a 20 minute episode just because there's a little bit of a, a little case of the I got it's. Like certain complex games or, or huge games would be like, man, I played for 40 minutes and I didn't even begin to properly. Uh, oh shit. Oh no. I got the Waller power back, which is bad. But like a big crazy game, there's a, there's a thing of like, oh man, I played for 50 minutes and still feel, feel like I barely touched the surface. I almost feel bad about putting this episode out because like, oh man, it's just such a... It just doesn't even scratch the surface. It's like, what, what, for, what, 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 it feels like I'm doing something wrong. But then I play certain arcade games, it's like, yeah, pretty much got it in five minutes. <laughs> which isn't a slight against the game, it's just like... If it's Pac-Man, a similar thing occurs. Like, alright, it's pretty much this. Whoop. I got more bubs. It's almost a surprise when I'm doing stuff with the uh, bubbles again. This cat's adapting really well to the weird power. I mean, dog. This, this corgi's adapting really well to these weird new powers, like the ability to wall jump, which melee dogs can do. There's some really cool tricks where they, like a, a dog's jumping over a fence and they do it by like wall running, and it's like the coolest looking visual. No, no, go backward. No, go back. Oh shit. Okay. This gets surprisingly complicated when you're trying to do certain actions and you just quite you get, you get out of sequence. And you're like, oh no, no, I want you to go the other way. And suddenly you're, the uh, lack of options for input become a puzzle of their own, and you have to figure out how to turn your character around without running into a spike. Oh, that was a miss. No! And on top of those precision jumps, there was entire areas never found yet. Oh, that one added 160. World 1 completed. This game has worlds, and... I thought I was going to say more cutscenes, but I think that was just that screen. Two cat KOs. Aww. Platinum stars? Nine out of 60? What do you mean I beat 60 levels? No, I didn't. No, stars obtained is out of 62. <clears throat> so, so stars obtained. So th 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 there were 60 stars. That means there was 20 levels. Gotcha. So I must have gotten platinum on three levels. You must be able to unlo only unlock platinum stars in intervals of three. I assume is that if you get all three, if you get three stars, it becomes platinum star. I don't know. It's confusing. It's confusing. This this will give you bobber bubbles while these uh, whilst in these bubbles. Press A button to bob upwards. What? What what changed? What? I already had this power, it just looked different. Oh, it's infinite jumps though. So it's just my normal jump, but instead I can keep going and going and going until I hit a wall. But I also kind of can't escape it until I hit a wall. It's kind of uh, it's kind of flappy bird mode, isn't it? Especially when you're trying to get every single treat correctly. Uh-oh. Please land on your feet. There we go. Please do not die. Oh no, I missed one. Oh. Crushing. Only one star. The crushing feeling of knowing that I made the mistake of overcommitting. Oh, that makes I don't like that. It makes me nervous. 
No, I stabbed the cat in the eye with a spike. He's dead. He's dead forever. It came out the back of his skull. There's blood everywhere. <laughs> I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. Oh my god. Timed spikes. <laughs> nope. I just realized, oh god, it's gonna switch back. And then I was very wrong about the timing. Just when I first started sliding down that, that wall, I didn't realize that the wall was covered in spikes. So when I then realized the walls were covered in spikes, I, I panicked a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean a lot. Oh, you have plenty of time. You have like a warning. Gotcha. Beep, beep. Oh no, I'm a, I'm a mess. I'm a mess. And I'm fault, but the hitbox is so big that even though it looks really wrong, I'm still getting them all. Weird. This is more interesting than like a one button platformer thought, like, like seemed like it was going to be. There's some really weird abilities going on here. Yep. Oopsie. Oh. Oof. Whoop. Almost forgot about this ability. It totally looks like a fish with wings. Like it's a cheap cheap. I think that's what it looked like in the icon. Yeah, oh yeah, because they're all fish. That's why. Oh, it run wall. No! Horrible murdered pet. Ah. I'm gonna take a new approach to Schrodinger's cat. Whenever, whenever I die, that was a cat. Whenever I win, that was a dog. No dogs were harmed in the making of this. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. I'm gonna die. Oh. He even looked sad. It was a weird, tilted version of the pixel art that made his look like a, like he was crying. That was. Oh, Why is there a laser? Yeah, it kills you. I wasn't sure if it would like detect you and do something or if it- Nope, it just kills things. If I waited one second longer, it was gonna tell you- tell me what the laser does. In a Mega Man X sort of way. Where the level design indicates what the fuck's happening. Oh god. Oh no! Stress. I hope you like our all-new stress mechanics, where we stress you the fuck out. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. That's not where I thought you were gonna land at all. Oh yeah, this is totally the type of mechanic that would make me lose my patience on the completionism and make me definitely just focus on surviving. Like, so far it's more been because I'm doing a let's try. <laughs> If you keep not landing where I think you're gonna land. Ah! No! I, haven't I been past that part before? Why can't I control my character anymore? I'm getting so much worse. It's fine, it adds drama to the video. One last struggle at level. That's a good way to end things off. <laughs> there, that's probably what I did the first time. Oh. No. No! <laughs> it's so frustrating! <laughs> it's so frustrating trying to control them. That, like, uh, it's a really complicated environment to try to platform through, but it's also the location of an instant death laser that's moving. So there's a timing to it on top of everything else. 
Uh, just spamming a lot. We made it. Bing, bing. All right, we did it. Everyone, this was... Oh, I got 50 stars unlocked. I got, got a husky. Oh, the timing of that. that. Now I'm sad. I want the husky mask. Oh my god. Look at him. He's precious. He's great and I love him. Anyway. This has been Bubbles the Cat. If you want to check this out, there's a link to the Steam page in the description so you can play this for yourself. Uh, thank you to the developers for, sen for sending me a code so I can preview their game. Thanks for watching like always, guys, and I'll see you next time.